towards you? Yep. What are you trying to do? All right, so now that we got our nice organic compost here at the house, I'm gonna start setting up the uh, the raised the raised garden bed. So right now I just have one piece of uh, one by eight, and then once I get the soil up a little higher, I'm gonna add the second, and then uh, keep filling it up with the soil. And I put a little cardboard down on the ground there to uh, to prevent prevent some weeds from growing up. You know, just to try to keep them at bay for a while until my plants start growing. That's good. Now leave that there, Christian. I'm gonna put another wheelbarrow full right there. Okay. So, as you can see behind me, I got a lot of stuff going on in my little garden and. We're adding uh, two raised beds, and then we're gonna take a cow paneling and make yes. a U, so yes. we can have vining uh, seminal pumpkins and anything That's else true. that vines. We'll have it go up that uh, cow panel. 
That is true. We're gonna, ex <laughs> we're gonna expand over into there. But basically here I got uh, some just, just some of my specialty stuff that I'm trying to grow right now. I got elderberry, I got mulberry, I have loquat, uh, a couple avocado trees, banana trees, uh, Suriname cherry trees. I have a, a Barbados cherry tree out in the yard right now. And just some onions, basil, things that we use in the kitchen on the regular. So we're just trying to expand and make, you know, make, make more room, make more, more stuff to grow. We're going to keep, keep growing and, and just see where it takes us. You know, it's one of our hobbies and passions and we enjoy it. So uh, we get water from this 50 ga 55 gallon drum over here whenever it rains, which during the summertime here in Florida, it's raining all the time. So uh, we here? got some goldfish in there and basically we give them a little food here and there, but also any mosquitoes or anything that tries to lay any larva in there, those goldfish are gonna eat it up. So if you do have any kind of water like that, rain barrel stuff, those would be a good addition. Uh, you know to prevent mosquito larva and stuff like that growing inside of your stagnant water so and then I also get water from there and give it to my chickens too for their water for their drinking water so and over oh. there you get water from over there yep we have another uh, drain from the roof which I don't give the chickens the uh, roof drain water just because of it running over the shingles and uh, stuff like that so Thanks for watching and uh, stay tuned for the next episode. Hopefully, I got to get back to the store, get some more lumber, and we'll finish out the, uh, the raised bed. So, thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next one.